Hello all you Baffer mates out there, I'm Joe Fortuna and this is the Book of Joe. Now in today's video is going to be a very very short one because last week um, it was uh, Blasphemy Day. I was going to do a full video on my YouTube channel but decided against it. So what I wound up doing was doing a lot of short videos on my TikTok, link in the description. So if you are interested, um, here are what I put up on TikTok. Um, it was quite fun. It's basically all the different things that qualify as blasphemy. So I hope you enjoy. So today's Blasphemy Day, so we're going to have some fun videos throughout the day. So for example, blasphemy can be defined as the action of offensive speech sacrilegiously about God or sacred things. Sacrilege can be defined as the violation or misuse of what is considered sacred. Pop back again later for more. So one of the things about blasphemy that you are not allowed to edit any sacred text which is funny because the bible has been translated from five different languages and has had various iterations additions and subtractions taken away funny that blasphemy also means any criticism of people who talk on behalf of god is also a bad thing so it's a bad thing to make fun of kenneth copeland for example you know the guy who likes to blow covid I think that's what he did. It's uh, also blasphemous to make fun of that uh, blonde Christian bloke on TikTok, you know, the one who cries a lot because he loves Jesus so much it brings him to tears. At least that's why I think he's crying. Either that or he's got permanent allergies. Do you know what else counts as blasphemy? Now, if I did that like a hundred years ago, I would have gotten arrested at best and executed at worst. So yeah, kind of silly when you think about it. Another fun thing is that parody also counts as blasphemy. So if you get something that exists in the Bible and then you decide to reword it, that also counts as blasphemy. Kind of like this thing I wrote a while ago. Now I know there's a similar version on the new Sabrina, which I haven't actually watched yet. So I kind of wrote it myself. So it's not actually from there. So don't do me, don't tell me for plagiarism. Hail Lilith, mother of lust, Satan is with thee. Loved art thou amongst women and loved is the fruit of thy loins, the whore of Babylon. Sweet Lilith, mother of freedom, a kiss for us sinners. Now and till the end of all days, hail Lilith. Well, this quote from the Bible was fun, so let's do some more of it. Even though I walk through the valley of the fading light, I will fear no right hand, for Satan is with me. Your fruit and your goals, they support me. You prepare a table for me in the presence of the pious. You anoint my head with wine, my glass overflows. Surely reason and compassion will follow me all the days of my life, and I will dwell in the temple of Satan forever. And now for my last bit of blasphemy for the day, the Dark Lord's Prayer. Join me, won't you? Our Father who art in hell, unhallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom is come, thy will is done on earth as it is below. We take this night our righteous day and trespass on faithless taboos. Lead us into temptation and deliver us from false parties. For ours is the world, the riches and the glory, forever and ever. Hail Satan. Hail blasphemy and hail thyself. Well that's basically it. I do hope you enjoyed them. Once again don't forget to like, share and subscribe. Links to all of my social media are down in the description. And remember to live life deliciously.